Hi, my name is Danny Asensio. I'm a trainer at the Gold's Gym in Bothell, and we're going to be bringing you another trainer tip video. All right, Gold's Gym members, we are very excited that we have a new tire flip for you guys. So, in order to use the tire flip, there's a couple things you're going to want to know. First of all, I would not recommend lifting with a conventional deadlift stance. So as you approach the tire, you're going to take a sumo stance, a bit wider past the hips. You're going to get down, you're going to want to lift with the legs while keeping your back straight and of course keeping lots of tension in your abs. And as you come up, uh, if the tire is a fairly easy lift for you at 160 pounds, then the momentum itself, you'll be able to carry that forward with your arms as you flip it. However, if you are a bit shorter or if that 160 pounds is a bit more difficult of a lift for you then you may need to make some modifications so you'll still use the sumo stance at the bottom you'll lift the tire up and as you get to your waist level you're going to tuck your knee under the tire and you're going to need to kind of pop it up and get your arms under the tire from there you should be able to just move forward and push it to the other side <laughs> this is so, so good. Bruh. Make sure one of you gets that nice, nice rounded back in there. That's probably going to start filming. <laughs> <laughs> 